on this beautiful little golf course putting green here. And we just saw this fox stick his head out of that hole over there. As a matter of fact, we heard him grumble. He was like, row, row. sound like a dog. Row, row. Now we're waiting to see if I'll come back out again. Yes. Oh, there he is. Shh, look, there he is. There's his little head. He just poked his head out. Shh, look, don't move. Don't move. Uh, is that the... <gasps> it's a little baby fox. I miss... Shh, 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 shh. You see any foxes? Oh, yeah. Where are the foxes? They're out on the island. They have a couple of dens out there. I saw a den over on this side. Hey, 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 hey! Oh. No loitering, all right? What a beautiful day. We are not scared. We're going to go set up our fox camera at the golf course. Um, coming up over here. And uh, I'm I'm doing the camera work, and Jessica's doing the driving this morning. But it's just a very and I'm a very good driver. Well, it's just very really big. Head southeast. Anyway, Shawnee we're gonna go do some fox stop. camera setting up. Oh man, I am really very multi-skilled. I drive. I run the camera. I get the napkins. You can't see. It's just over the hill, but there's a little fox hole over there. We don't feed them. We haven't and won't try to catch them or anything like that. We're just observing. We have this outdoor camera that's specifically made for this purpose. It's a wildlife camera and it is camouflaged. Ideally they won't even notice it um, and we just kind of scope them out because they're really cute and really cool. So we always have a family of fox on the golf course. Raccoons, uh, deer, uh, bear, all those things are, are on the island here. I have pictures of myself uh, where I was actually teeing off and a raccoon came and knocked my ball off the tee. <laughs> so, I mean, there are pictures of that. So they can be kind of mischievous. Two balls, Wyatt. Two Easter eggs. Look, there's a big bug flying around us. Bugs are really brave. I mean, if you saw a giant, would you just go over to it and start flying around it? Or would you run in the opposite direction of it? What would you do if you saw a giant? Alex, would you be like, there's a giant. I should go fly around it. I don't know. I should, should go, I should go try to bug that giant. Punch it as hard as I could. Really? You'd run over to it and punch it? I don't know. Like a real, like a human giant or like a giant bug or? Yeah, like a massive monster. But it resembled a human? Yeah, but it, I no. I to talk to it, I don't know. No, no, if it were like a monster, a giant monster. Oh, I'd run. Right, I'd run. you'd run or you'd hide or something. So we have just collected our fox cam. There's the fox's hole. And we're looking, it sounds like it did not work. No, it did. It did? Yeah. Foxes are small to medium sized omnivorous mammals. Did I say that right? Omnivorous. Omnivorous mammals belonging to the Candidae family. Foxes have a flattened skull, upright triangular ears, a pointed slightly upturned snout, and a long bushy tail, also called a brush. The most common and widespread species of fox is the red fox. They are prominent in popular culture and folklore around the world for their widespread reputation of being very cunning. Male foxes are known as dogs, tods, or reynards. Female foxes are known as vixens. And young cubs are known as pups or kits. 
Who is that going in there? Who? What's going on? Is there a person? It's a groundhog in there. Whoa, really? A groundhog went into the foxhole? <laughs> 